Hello guys, Dusty here with finally another YouTube video. Yes, I just had a busy week. I haven't been able to get to recording videos, but now I should be hopefully back um, relatively permanently. So, uh, yeah, I decided to go with a kind of topical video again. Um, how do I clean my records? Because, as you can see, I have... Let's see if I can get out of the way here. I, I have records, and they require cleaning. Because, see, I didn't buy all these records new. I actually bought them from, you know, pawn shop, thrift stores, garage sales. A lot of garage sale records in there. Uh, and they and when and when records have you know sat around for about forty years, they start to get a little bit dirty, and they need to be cleaned. So I have a couple methods that I use to clean records. First one, this is the preliminary like, okay, the record's probably clean enough for me to just immediately put it on the table, or I already cleaned it with the second method. So I, I actually clean my records every time I play them with this. This is um, a generic e kind of. Um, I don't know, it's a cleaning puck, basically. You just, you put a record on, let's see if I can demonstrate this. I think I have a record out right here, yep, doors. So you take the record out of the sleeve. Careful, careful, careful. Don't wanna damage its contents. And then you throw this on the turntable, like so. Yeah. Get it spinning. And then, Take this nifty thing. You do that. Get rid of it. Wipe off all the dirt. And then you start playing. It's that simple. If my amplifier was on, sound would be coming out right now, but it isn't, so there's none. All right, so that is number one method. And this also comes with a nifty little thing right here, a stylus brush. So. If, let's just say your stylus is dirty, because it's going to get dirty playing all these dirty records, just give her a little brush. And, you know, it's clean now. Woohoo! Yay. Yeah, I usually do that also every time I uh, play a record, because it's just quick and easy and simple. Uh, though I don't think it matters to do as much as, you know, cleaning your records that frequently. So now, for like the heavy duty cleaning stuff, the main, the main apparatus in which I use to clean all these records. <sighs> this. Spin clean. You probably have heard of one of these things before if you've been in the vinyl community for any period of time. Uh, yeah, it's a spin clean, record cleaning system. As you can see, they've been around for 40 years. And uh, this one, what do I have to say about the spin clean? I'm planning on doing a little review of the spin clean at some point, but well, let's get started with it's a hundred dollars. Oh, uh, I'm sorry. Uh, I think I've eaten too many too many greasy things lately. Uh, that or I just that or I just said something crazy like this thing is a hundred dollars. Oh. Oh, okay, okay, I'm, I'm back, I'm back, okay. It's, it's a hundred dollars. <sighs> but, I actually managed to get this for 50% off. So it was only fifty dollars for a piece of plastic. Yay! But, but in all seriousness, it does really do its job. It, it does what it sets out to do, which is basically, it cleans your records, comes with, comes with the cleaning solution, drying cloths, and these little brushes that go in. And then, I'm sure you all know how spin clean works, but you basically, you basically just spin your, spin your record manually, and you fill this full of water with the cleaning solution, and it cleans your records! Voila! Yeah. And it does work incredibly well, I have to say. Um, and though I would say it's definitely not worth its full price price tag, oh, I'm not, I'm not going to fall over again. I'm not. I, re I refuse to. But yeah, this thing's way too expensive. <laughs> yeah, I hope, you, I hope you enjoyed this short video on how I record my, uh, record my records. Another topic that might come in the future, how I record my records. Granted, I don't do that very often. Only for, like, records that I can't get on Google Play or something like that. But, 
If you want to see that, by all means, let me know in the comments. But uh, let me know in the comments also how you guys clean your records, because I'm always open to suggestion. Um, and I'm sure everybody who's contemplating sending a hundred dollars on um, this hunk of plastic might be, uh, <laughs> you know, considering different options. Uh, and yeah, I know you can. I know you can for like twice the price buy other record cleaning solutions, mostly you know vacuum and dry cleaning kind of situations and machines, but yeah, um, I, I couldn't afford to go that high up. So $50 was like my budget. Granted, it was free shipping, but still $50. I, I, I'm, I'm never going to get over that. But anyway, this has been Dusty. Let me know how you clean your records in the comments. Uh, and yeah, I'll see y'all next time. Take it easy.